Hello guys, welcome back to another update video. So, today it is Wednesday, October 16th, 2024. So, of course, let's obviously start off by, of course, going to my channel. My god, that tab list has gotten so freaking big. First of all, sub count. You should know the deal at this point. Last time we had 1,326 subscribers. Now we have 1,339. And this is actually my first time checking it since the last update video. So, wow! That is a total of... 13 new subscribers in 7 days? Literally, I'm not kidding when I say this. I have not checked this since the last update video. So, wow! Did not realize it got up that high. 13 more in seven days. Insane! We'll see where we are on October 23rd. As for the videos, let's see what's taken over for the week. We have backed reveals for Night of Lights 2024 Day 3, Chilling on Stupid PS Episode 273, Legos Island for a small free item room 23 update, and looking at past Halloween items. Back your reveals for Night of Lights 2023, uh, sorry, 2024 Day 2. Lego Master 627's creations for creating the Zola's Lab 2 2023 Halloween Skyscraper. Back your views for getting back to normal after the hurricane. And the surprise introduction of Night of Lights. Club Penguin Journey for CBJ Times 41 and a half. Chilling on Civic PS episode 272. Club Penguin Experience for the Hello Codes and Jet Black Codes. Oh. I forgot to put an O in codes there. Give me a minute. Okay, I am very glad I noticed that. This, as you can see, it's fixed now. Club Penguin Experience again for the Astro Barrier Ship Pin and the Surprise Rookie Meetup that literally came out of nowhere. Then, Club Penguin Imagine for Halloween Construction and Rory Meetup, which also came out of nowhere. Then, welcome back, Club Penguin Journey. Then, Legos Island for the Halloween Theme Park Prize Booth, Sunny Vlog 360, the What's Going On Vlog, Solo's Lab 2 for the Halloween 2024 construction, Back Reveals for Second Hurricane Aftermath, Chilling on Sleep PS Episode 271, Legos Island for creating the Legos Island 6th and 7th Anniversary Statues. Then, Chilling on Sleep PS Episode 270. Then, the Club Penguin Journey is returning, and lastly, the update video from a week ago. You see, this update video was filmed an hour before this. Uh, what I mean by is an hour before Club Penguin Journey was announcing its return. Which means we can go back to playing Club Penguin Journey in the update videos. So overall, this entire week has been mostly CBPS content. Which apparently you guys really like a lot. And even back... A while back as well, too. Uh, Blizzard has a queue. I'm not going to do that this time. Who knows how long it's going to be in there. Trust me. You don't understand what I've seen. The queues get really freaking nuts. Let's go ahead and mute that. Because we do not need that playing. Oh, nice. Nice. Give me a second. I'll send this back to them. Um, but yeah, let's talk about stuff, and like, I'm actually like dead serious, let's actually talk about stuff, because, oh, we got a lot to talk about today, we got a lot to freaking talk about, and it is going to be interesting, <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all freaking right, let's talk, let's freaking talk about stuff, man. Uh, just for the record, by the way, I'll just be right here for no reason. Freaking, we're just gonna play fair games while I do this. <laughs> yeah, what am I thinking? So, first off, we need to talk about Zola's Up 2. For a completely different reason from what I was supposed to actually tell you in this video. You see, the Halloween Party 2024 for Zola's Lab 2 is meant to start on October 17th, 2024, alongside the Zola's Lab 3 one on October 20th. Speaking of Zola's Lab 3, I want to apologize there hasn't been an episode since the beginning of the month. 
Uh, first off, that is clearly my fault. The fair still hasn't been taken down. And fun fact, I was actually about to do that, uh, many hours before I made this update video. But this is where I talk about what I wasn't planning to talk about in this video. <sighs> Guys, I have unfortunate news. History has repeated itself. We can't access the labs. That's right. We can't access the freaking labs right now. That's right. That is freaking right. Do any of you guys remember where... Um, do you guys remember where throughout April and May of 2024 where um, physically we couldn't get the Minecraft launcher to update on my computer? Um, I guess good? Somehow? I don't know! The shutdown was, uh, interesting. And depressing. I'm referring to the Clothing and Journey shutdown. That was depressing as heck. But back to what I was saying, though. <laughs> yeah. I went on to Rose Crystal's PC, and granted, she's not here right now. She actually left on Sunday to, of course, go back to her college apartment to, of course, continue college classes. Of course. Um, but I went on her lap, on her PC earlier, uh, like almost nearly the beginning of the day, and the launcher wouldn't update. That's right. The launcher wouldn't freaking update on her PC. And don't worry, before you all ask, I do have good news. I am completely fine. Nothing's wrong here. See? In the game, just fine. No issues. But, it seems like now we have to do the same thing for Rose Crystal. You see, the reason and how I was able to get back into the game back in May of 2024 was uninstalling the entire game and reinstalling the entire game back onto my PC and everything was just fine. I feel like we're going to have to do the same for Rose Crystal. And thank God she isn't here to experience this. If she happens to be watching this by chance, uh, yeah, it happened. But because I am not the one who is going through it, we're not going to worry about it for right now. What I can tell you is that both Halloween parties will be delayed by a week. The Zolazap 2 one will start on October 24th and end November 7th, replacing what would have been um, a mini event that was meant to occur immediately after it ended, which I think if I recall was a Western party. Yeah, that's just going to get cut out in favor of the Halloween party being delayed. Because if we ended the Halloween party, like, the day after Halloween, the party would only be on for, like, eight days. That would be, like, the shortest Halloween party we've ever done in the lab's history. So, yeah. And then the Zola's that free one will... Yeah, I'm kind of... Exactly what I just said there, but it's just going to be one day shorter. Like, it's going to be, like, seven days. I know, I know, that's not long at all for something like this, but... Granted... At this point, I don't know. I clearly don't know. But for right now, yeah, it's going to be interesting. So for right now, the labs are unaccessible. But hopefully, unlike how I got locked out, hopefully we can resolve this way, way, way quicker. Now that I have talked about that, it's time to talk about something I can confirm will come out on time. The Legos Island and Lego Master 627's Creations Halloween events. Yeah, those I can confirm will come out on time. Let's talk about the Legos Island one since that's meant to come out before the Creations World one. 
You see, it's time I finally reveal its theme. Because I think I did say in the last update video that I think I would reveal it in the next one. Well, it's finally that time. Are you all ready to see the theme for Legos Island Halloween 2024? The event's in like five days as of recording this update video since it's on the 21st of October. Or just October 21st. You get the idea, though. I might have to wait until I'm not playing this game right here for a second. Because, yeah, we're going kind of freaking nuts. Oh, frick, that was in the wrong direction. Actually, you know what? I have to put the game right there just so I can get my phone in and read this. Because I can't be doing this both at the same time. Okay. 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 Actually, okay, yeah, this is charged. Yep, this is charged. Um, let's talk. All right, and I found it. All right, Legos Island Halloween 2024 is the eighth one to occur on Legos Island. Construction for the event begins October 19th. It starts October 21st and ends November 4th. Now, here's where we get into the theme, because that info you already knew. Here's what you didn't know about the events. The corrupted island seen in Legos Island. Operation Legos Island 2024 returns. As Cool Guy 33 said, it would make a good Legos Island Halloween design. And I agree. It will return with Halloween decorations. There will be items every single day of this party. Well, at least up until Halloween, of course. Then, by the end of the party, there will be a candy hunt. Fun facts. This theme was suggested by Cool Guy 33 You see... Back in the original Operation Legos Island 2024 finale, back in the Operation Legos Island 2024 finale, we could see that there was a comment read by CoolGet33. Corrupted Future would be a good Legos Island Halloween design. And I said, oh indeed. I can confirm, eight months later, it's a legitimate reality. Of course, this will, of course, be altered with, of course, some Halloween decorations. But, hopefully with some new custom elements to make it, hopefully, a lot more different. And to be quite honest, Cool Game 33 is not wrong about this. This, honestly, would look so cool for Halloween Party. Of course, minus all the snow, of course. This, honestly, would look so cool for Halloween Party. And I think, yeah, he has the right idea. So we're definitely making that a reality. It's going to be really cool to see how we can transform this into something interesting. And more creepy than it already was. Now, of course, with all of that in mind, now that we have that out of the way, we can confirm the Corrupted Future will be returning in this upcoming Halloween party. But now with an even more creepier theme than it already was back in February. Because that's where we originally saw it. But now it's going to be taking on a much better twist. Personally, I think you guys are going to love it. And I think the face cam just froze. Oh, there goes that. Oh, wow. Yep, face cam just froze. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> um, at least you guys can still see what I'm doing. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, let's grab uh, this and let's grab and grab this what else can we grab we can grab yep we can grab that there we go can we grab this by chance uh i'm gonna grab yeah i'm gonna grab this since it's a lot more expensive and then i'll grab this at a later time so yeah now, for Legos out for Lego Master 627's creations, I do want to confirm something. There's no specific theme for this one. In fact, I don't think there's ever been an official theme. Well, except for 2021 and 2022, if you want to be real specific. Listen, though, I'll tell you though, it's gonna be really cool. Prepare for a lot of slime in there, just to be specific. <laughs> That's one thing I can tell you. Prepare for a lot of slime. Much like 2019, but not to that extent. God, no. We're not going to the extent that we did in 2019 with all that slime. God, freaking no. That took forever to clean up. Trust me, it's way smaller than that in terms of the slime. But, yep. Yeah. With all that said, that's really all I have to say regarding the Creations World one. Uh, 
Night of Lights has been going insanely well for the backyard. You guys are seeming to really like it. I don't know if you've managed to notice. The event's been getting bigger and bigger every single night. And I want to let you guys know, that was actually not my idea. You want to know whose idea that was? My mom's idea. To make the event bigger every single night. And I'm not kidding when I legitimately say that. I'm not making that up. That is a real thing I can say. But... Yeah, with all that being said, guys, we still got two more nights of that. Please look out for that. With all that said, guys, I'm going to end. And also because, again, my webcam froze up. <laughs> this happens on occasion with certain update videos. I don't know why it does. You know, a while back, it was happening to Rose just a whole lot, and it seems like I've now taken that over. With all that said, guys, I will see you all in the next one on Wednesday, October 23rd, where we'll have more Halloween events to talk about. See you then!